Before we get into the video, do not forget to like, comment and subscribe. Now just before I start, I want to say I appreciate everybody that's watching these videos. Now that's all said and done, let's get down to it. After a man was arrested for climbing up on the BBC London's headquarters in order to hammer at the statue that depicts Prospero and Ariel from Shakespeare's play The Tempest on Wednesday, January 12th, a major conversation has been sparked. The BBC have flat out said they are not going to change or get rid of the statue, despite the fact that the statue was created by Eric Gill in the 1930s, who was a really disgusting human being. I mean, he was probably the lowest of the lowest low, low scum. In his diaries, he had affairs, he had abused his two daughters, and he even messed around with his pet dog. According to the BBC, the statue is the standard for new journalism and people have to be able to separate art from the artist's personal matters. But also, a lot of people beg to differ. Now it's obvious the man who risked his freedom does not agree with the statue of the naked boy, so police were called to the broadcasting house at roughly 4.15pm on Wednesday, following reports of a man using a ladder to scale 10 feet to reach the famous statue. As he wrote the words pedo and time to go as well as hammering away at the statue, two men were seen trying to negotiate with the unknown protester to stop defacing that same statue. For anyone who has children, I can see why the protester would be so passionate about what he did. And the man was actually up on the statue for over four hours before the London Fire Brigade got him down and he has since been arrested for criminal damage. What do we think of this? Is he justified on defacing a statue, or did he go overboard? Let me know. Stay safe. Safe.